All right, Mike here at Sky Include, keeping you included in the sky. <laughs> The new internet, I mean, there's so many amazing new technologies coming out. I know it's overwhelming even for me. I mean, uh, over less than a year for, for a lot of this stuff, and some is even younger. Anyway, there's a hot topic, YAT or Y.AT. Uh, it's a new like emoji name, blockchain naming system. And uh, they just had some auctions in right on April Fool's Day, April 1st. Day before my birthday and uh, 2021, and it seemed like it did uh, really well. I mean, people spent, a, depending on how you define well, people spent a lot of money on it, and people have been finding our blogs, finding our YouTube videos, asking me on Telegrams all over the place, what's the difference of Handshake and Yat? So I just feel like I have to make this urgent video. It's just a couple of days after uh, that auction, and uh, we're just getting so much traffic. People are asking us about Handshake emoji domains like crazy. It's it's really uh, exploding. So disclaimer, obviously, I'm heavily invested in Handshake personally with time, this content, my knowledge, the community, the people, the events. So I'm going to try to not be too biased. I'm really trying to. But I just uh, so, of course, obviously, I have somewhat of a biased perspective. Um, the one thing I like about Handshake is there's not a lot of hype. There's not a lot of this pushing marketing speak. But uh, maybe that's a bad thing in a way because people don't know about it still or people are just finding out about it. But so we got this question in Telegram from uh, Dougal just uh, on Saturday night, the day after the uh, auctions and uh, of Yat. And he says, uh, Handshake is a cheaper way to buy emoji domains. Considering buying a yeah emoji domain, but Handshake is coming up. Any advice? Appreciate it. First of all, we don't want to be known as the cheaper option. Like we, uh, we actually had like a huddling call. A lot of us in the community, you know, again, we're, we're totally like, I don't work for Handshake. There's no like Handshake company. Of course, there's Namebase, which is a huge one, comp private company, but that's not Namebase. That's a company. Uh, separate from the handshake protocol but uh, you know we had a, a huddle a little bit a lot of us um, so we're just trying to prepare how to explain this to everybody so I my response uh, again this is a little bit of an ugly text blog I'm going to clean it up just want to get the video made first but basically um, handshake is a protocol on it's a handshake as a blockchain so a blockchain that's a top level domain so it'd be dot emoji um, or just like an it could be text or an emoji it doesn't have to be. it's not just emojis and uh, I have another tutorial which you should check out about emoji domains um, this I've been invested in this for a few for a while uh, so you can check into this and uh, and read about it also please be a little bit careful unfortunately on name base there's a lot of fake ones and I'm sorry about that I hope we can get rid of the fake ones because um, it's hurting I believe some of our legitimacy in the handshake ecosystem but um, just don't Buy fake ones, please. Anyways, um, but on the Yat, uh, I've studied it. I, I did actually view some of the auctions. They, they're really doing good design, good marketing, good uh, Y.AT, right? So they had this auction, and uh, it looks really, it's really beautiful design. I mean, really, really nice. Um, so this is one of their, their different auctions finished, and this is some of the prices. Uh, they also were accepting credit card for, for Handshake right now. I don't, I think Namebase might be working on a debit card, but for now, there I don't think there's yet a way to buy it with a credit card or a fiat. But, uh, so you have to use HNS token, but with, uh, yeah, you could have, as I was told, I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't uh, purchase any. Um, you could uh, buy it uh, with a credit card which I do agree is a little bit helpful. So these are some of the emoji domains that they had. And um, this is how it will work. I saw, so one is like rocket moon, this one. So that was for uh, 200,000 US, which is pretty, uh, pretty nice <laughs> investment here. So you can see rocket moon here, okay. It's a puny code. Okay, watch it. Hit enter, and then it redirects to y.at slash rocket moon. And uh, again, uh, I have a I have a video about emoji keyboards too. Skyinclude.com slash emoji dash keyboard, um, which I do I dive deep in this. So it's basically um, I don't want to do too much on this video, but same with uh, it's basically the same. It's puny codes emojis 
in key in in in, uh, in a keyboard are uh, puny codes. Okay, sorry, maybe I didn't uh, publish it or, but it's you'll see it. I'll, I'll link it in the show notes. So that's how that works. But of course, let's compare this to Handshake. Um, so one of my favorites is uh, I do own it is the uh, eyes closed, tongue sticking out here. That was the emoji keyboard I just used. Slash enter. And this is it. It doesn't look as pretty, right? Because I think that's why Yad is forwarding it to subfolder. Because if it was on the on a subdomain, it would show like uh, puny code. See, um, so that might not be as as uh, ideal looking, right? So maybe that's the reason that they forward it to a subpage. But it's a s it's a subdomain of a SLD, right? There's .at which is on DNS. There's Y which is their domain name, and then you, you as a customer or the owner of this own, I believe this page. And I guess you could put a profile here. You can use it probably for crypto payments. And uh, so this is a Flamingo Handshake, um, which is the site we built. So I do agree. I not as nice of a design here. Uh, we'll be upgrading this very soon. But these are the puny codes, and this is a uh, emoji of this puny code. But uh, you know, so basically, this is what you would own in Handshake, and then you could have anything you want before it. Dot this, anything before it. Uh, dot that. So you would own just like dot com. You'd own dot emoji, or just a word on Handshake ecosystem. Um, and yeah, like the question from Dougal was, why is the prices so much lower? I, I would agree. I, I think it's because we're, as a handshake community, we're not as good hyping this and marketing this and doing ads and, and uh, influencer outreach. We're more technical. Even me, I'm a little bit introverted. I mean, I like to help you make these videos. But um, And then another, another user's question, answer was, um, yeah, similar. Like you can have H HTTP colon slash emoji on handshake. Um, or shop dot, you know, this, and also definitely Mark Smith, you can check it out on a Namer News post. I'll link it up. He wrote a really long explanation. Just uh, yeah, he's he's bought some of the handshake ones, and he says this sold for sixty thousand U.S. dollars on uh, on Yat. Um, so you can read his too. But he's he's giving you a little bit more of the numbers. Uh, I'm trying to give you more of the little bit of. Oh, he also talks about a technical C. Um, basically, it's a yeah, is you have access to the subdomain and the subpage. Um, but Y is owned on .at, and .at is ICANN domain, which controls .at. So, um, of course, I'll probably integrate with ENS domains, which is like blockchain enabling of traditional ICANN domains. But Handshake is trying to be its completely independent blockchain that complements or is a soft fork of the current domain name system um if that makes sense i i hope that makes sense let me uh even on sky include right we have sky include.com but we also have sky include slash so this is this is our uh domain for sky include and then you can have set up dot sky include you know uh where we put our blog so I hope this makes sense. I, I don't know. I know I'm a little bit technical. I, I have tons of videos about Handshake, uh, and I'm trying to give you my unbiased feedback. Um, but as far as what you own, you own like the rights to this emoji on the Y.AT ecosystem. And uh, I think they'll probably make it where you can buy and sell these, and then you could use these to receive crypto payments and uh, put your profile on it, uh, from my understanding of it. Um, but it's honestly fascinating to see this so much interest in emojis um you know a lot of times people in the traditional domain space say that they're not popular on the dot ws or dot uh other one but uh they're really hot in handshake and now with yeah they really exploded so it's uh it's overwhelming thank you i hope this helps i'm trying to be unbiased but of course obviously i think uh, handshake is a better tech solution i'm a tech guy thank you also, a little plug, we're going to put together an auction on uh, handshake domains at flamingohandshake.com. Um, it's not yet ready yet. Uh, it's really trying to put together uh, as fast as we can to get you access to some of these amazing single uh, emojis. So stay tuned. It'll probably be in mid-April. Flamingohandshake.com. Thank you.